everyone. My name is Sarah and I am Kim and I am the chair of the IWC South Korea chapter. I am very glad that we can join the as the 29th IWCA the chapter and be the one of the global community global coffee community. South Korea chapter, uh, we have eight board members, including me. So I am going to introduce some uh, all of them here. Today, uh, one member, Won Hee Kang, in Peru cannot join because of the internet connection problem. Other than him, everyone's joined this meeting. So, first, I'm going to introduce Mira Song. Can you sell it? Can you say hello? Uh, Mira, can you hear us? Yes, this is uh, Mira Song. And here we have uh, uh, the hello. Laura. Laura. I think, she, as I know, she's traveling now, she's in the train station. And uh, here's a Kelly. Hi. Yeah, and here is Eileen. Hi. Yeah, and here is Saul. And as Hi. I know, I think she's preparing her, opening her the restaurant business right now. So, uh, yeah, so I think we, I introduced all, all here. Easy was here, I think suddenly it's not here. So these are all our eight, me our eight board members uh, in South Korea chapter. We are very glad that we can start that this is our first day, first step of I, as an IWCA a member. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Sarah. And, uh, you know, I take this opportunity to congratulate all of you leaders of the IWCA South Korea chapter who initiated the formation of this chapter. So as we close this year, 2021, we are proud to incorporate your chapter into our IWCA global network as the 29th chapter. And so South Korea will be also be our fifth consuming country chapter. So we started as a more of producing country chapters. And in the past few years, we've had it consuming country chapters and you will be our fifth consuming country chapter. And this will actually expand our market access opportunities for our producing country chapters and the members of those chapters. And uh, so I'm very impressed at how your chapter has been organized, that you already within, uh, um, before, even before signing the MOU, you already have 40 members. And so I, am, uh, I wanna wish all of you in the coming year, very, uh, great success in all your endeavors and uh, uh, envisioning uh, your future as a chapter and the con uh, connecting with all our other chapters. So uh, I look forward to working with all of you. And from IWCA Global, I want to introduce, we have one of our board members who has joined us today, Susie Spindler. And uh, Susie probably does not need much introduction because she is very well known in the coffee industry as the founder of the Alliance for Coffee Excellence and Cup of Excellence. And then we have also Blanca Castro needs no introduction. She has been working diligently with all of you in have make, ensuring that you're for, you are uh, adhering to all the protocols and she has been there along the entire way, helping you form the chapter. And uh, so, and then Jimena uh, Lane Fiesta also joined us who has also been helping Blanca with uh, the chapter formation. So I want to congratulate all of you. <laughs> And so with that, we have our IWCA MOU. Um, uh, uh, both of us, both Sarah and I have the uh, MOU that is ready and she has the copy that is signed by me and I have the copy that is signed by her. So let me pin both of us and let's go ahead and sign the, uh, sign the uh, MOU, where is Sarah? Okay, Sarah, you ready to sign? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> so we have signed the MOU and I know it's hard to see with my background. So she can, yeah, you can see uh, from Sarah's screen. 
So I am really congratulations and um, in forming a chapter and we look forward to working with you. Thank you. Um, we are very honored to become the 29th the chapter. We start uh, late, I think. We should start it for, earlier than this. We start with a small group of people, but I think very the people with the integrity. So I believe we can do lots of things. Um, as the IWCA South chapter, we will follow the IWC's mission. We shall empower women in the international coffee community to achieve sustainable and meaningful lives and also encourage and recognize the participation of women in all aspects of the coffee industry. We will be the first people who will stand up and offer our hands for the underprivileged women and people in coffee community. I think that's all we need to do in, and I'm very, very excited to start our first step today. 